What's up guys? Me and Slinky, we're heading down to Bradenton, Florida. Cletus McFarlane, you know, the famous Freedom Factory. We're gonna go down there, we're gonna play in some mud. All right guys, so we're down here in Bradenton, Florida. We're about 10 minutes away from the Freedom Factory. We had to stop at one of our old jobs real quick to go ahead and grab some water so we can head on over there to knock this job out for Cletus. This truck right here, it's a Vactor. It holds about 2,500 gallons of water. So you get a new haircut? Oh yeah. Check it out. I didn't even know barbershops were open. <laughs> look, he done edged you up and everything. Turn around. Ooh, look at you. Eyebrows. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. I'm ready to roll. My man styling and profiling. Yes, sir, All right, guys, so let me go ahead and just explain what we're going to be doing out there. So the company that we have, I work for, me, dad, Tyler, mom, all of us together, we own SNS Vac and Video Services. Uh, so we're going to take this Vac truck. We're going to go to the Freedom Factory. He has got a storm system out there. I think it's got four or five great inlets. We're going to try to go in there. We're going to clean out the inlets. We're going to try to run through, clean out the pipe, make sure he's got no blockage. Cletus got a big event coming up, plus more big events following behind that for the rest of the year. So we want to make sure when it does rain that none of his property goes ahead and goes into flooding or doing anything stupid like that. So we want to make sure the drains are perfectly clean so all kinds of freedom can roll through them things. We're here, boys. Freedom Factory is opening up. Check out this gate. It's a serious gate right there. Smells like Freedom Spirit in there. Let's go, Slink. So we're getting started on our first great inlet. Already messing up Cleese's Freedom Factory, plus with the concrete, but we're gonna have that all fixed and ready for whenever we leave here. As you can see down inside this hole, it is flat full of weeds, trees, roots, everything. We're gonna go ahead and get that out. Have to buy, uh, bring that heavy ass truck out here. Hopefully I don't mess up his grass too much. Get this line clean, it heads on over there. This one goes underneath the burnout pack. So like, show them that brand new burnout pack. Oh, 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 man. Some skippy yippies? <laughs> Some flippy yippies? <laughs> oh, I already made you a mess. Oh, I'm already messing up your whole freedom map. It 
won't hurt as bad, especially being up here. So. I know you spent a lot of time. Put it in. It looks nice. Oh, oh, He might get sad if I mess up his grass. <laughs> I'll pull you up. Right, guys so we're getting set up right now so he's over there grabbing our tubes like you can see him in the back he's getting our tubes ready we're gonna go ahead and suck this box out real fast go ahead and run this jet line get this thing all completely unclogged completely clean for cletus out here so he can have full freedom over here at the freedom factory we're gonna put the small jet head on it first make sure it goes through the pipe just in case we don't know what's inside here we don't know what's broke i don't want to get hung up and then we have to go through and dig up cletus's brand new nicely laid grass so we're gonna go ahead and take all the crossings Go through, make sure we do everything right, and do a good job for him. Alright guys, so that's one box down, one line about halfway. Slinky's bringing it back to him over there right now. It's going to be spit and spotless. You can actually eat off the bottom of this thing. But check this out. I just want to give you all a little look around. How big this facility is. I came out here for the first time. I've been racing at Bradenton for the last 10 years. And I have never stepped foot over in this facility until Cletus bought this track. And uh, he's turning around. He's doing a lot of great things. As you can see, He's put a lot of money into it. He's got that brand new concrete pad, brand new sod all around here, bleachers, new paint, new everything. This thing is huge. It's going to be a lot of great racing, a lot of great burnout contests, a lot of good concerts, a lot of fun down here at the Freedom Factory. And I'm actually proud and honored to just be a little part of it, to be able to get this thing rolling and get it done for my man out here. So he has nice, fresh, clean system.
got the water. <laughs> 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 Quick little update, I'm actually on top of the concrete pad right now. We have the vac truck set up at one of the boxes. We have came to realization that we believe one of the boxes is underneath this concrete pad. It's not the end of the world. I was just explaining to Cletus that uh, the only thing bad about it is, is I can't run my jet head up in here because I do not know if there's an invert inside the box. If my jet head was to fall off, get hung up in a pipe, how would we get it out? We'd have to cut the line and leave it down inside there. I mean, it'd probably make history, but I don't want to go down that road. So we're actually going to skip over these next two lines because we do know it's draining. This water system was slap full of water. He already got it drained out. So we know it's draining. It might not be 100% spotless, but it is working. So we're going to head on over here. There's one box that's right over here by those sprinklers. We have one box on the other side of that blue garbage can. And then we got one box on the other side of the scoreboard. Man, I had to come to the back of the property to be able to see what uh where the storm drain runs out to. It goes out here to the to the creek. So me and Slinky, we're like, man, we really don't feel like walking around. No. Cleet's like, just go ahead and take the side by side. So now I heard this is his baby. I can tell you right now, that thing is badass. I want to get one now. Freedom Factory Can Am. You, would you call this a six wheel drive or uh, four wheel drive? Two yeah. extra axles. Six wheel drive once you lock it in. You can lock this thing in six wheel drive. I feel like we could climb a fence, but we're not gonna mess up this no. stuff. If it was mine, I'd climb the fence, guys. All Cleet is having super fun in the water truck. We're done with our job out here. That water that's in the bottom of the pipe, that's just water that's out there in the creek. That's that level right now, so that's where it'll always be until they went out there and dig the creek out more. The water has somewhere to fall. But we got the pipes all cleaned up. We gotta get the truck completely unloaded, so we're actually gonna help Cletus by watering his grass. Hold on!
safe. It is full of freedom. Cletus can take all his bald eagles and run it through the storm system. Any kind of rain, any kind of snow, anything that comes down here to the Freedom Factory will drain out. Hit up SNS back in video if you need some back work, you need some TV work, any kind of services. Where are your guys? Well, that's it, folks. Me and Sleeky, hot, tired. It's like 100 degrees down here in Florida. We want to thank Cletus for having us come out here, clean all his storm drains. We got everything done for him. We're getting out of here. We're heading back to the house. We got more videos to, to shoot. If you haven't done already, subscribe to the channel. Like this video. Keep sharing it with your friends. Let's make it one of the best vlogging racing channels out there. Let's all have fun. We're growing together. We just hit 20,400 subscribers. Me and Slinky would not be able to do this without y'all. We're only going to get bigger. We're not going to stop. We're going to keep on bringing y'all the best content that we can bring. We're doing a lot of different things this year with the channel between my lifestyle, Sleekies, doing tips on the cars, racing. We got Street Outlaw, No Prep Kings. We're just getting everything ready. We want to bring a lot, a lot, a lot of content. So, uh, again, I want to thank Cletus for letting us come out here. It was awesome. I met Cletus a couple months ago, and uh, he's actually one of the probably the best dudes I've ever met before. And uh, he does very well. He's done a lot of good things for this uh I guess community and uh, down here at Bradenton Motorsports Park. You know, Victor owns the racetrack. Cletus is going to own the roundy track and the burnout pit. It's going to be awesome. You're going to be able to have a lot of fun times down here, a lot of big parties. So I'll see y'all at the next video. Remember, oh. subscribe to the channel. Hey, before y'all chew me up on YouTube and stuff on the comments, that's a birthmark. My barber did not mess up my hair. I have never had any hair grow here in my whole life. Why don't we tattoo a lawnmower and let him mow the lawn? <laughs> Mow, mow a bald spot in the back of your head. Drop a comment down below if you think we should tattoo a lawnmower on the side of Slinky's head. Mowing the bald spot. We'll see y'all at the next one.